Okay, so then we'll move into the ankle. Okay. Now one of the ones that you can do seated like this is what's this test here? You can see it. Um, yeah, basically it is vagus for the ankle, but there's somebody want to put their name on it. Yeah, Tiger's test. So there's a, a question about what's the difference. Now, what test is this? Taylor tilt. And what, what's the difference between the Taylor tilt and the Kliger's test? Cli Taylor tilt, I'm isolating at what joint? The joint between the uh, tibia and the talus. Okay, so I'm tilting the talus. Okay, so that's going to be the deltoid ligament here. Now if I'm doing this, then I'm adding more of the midfoot into it. Okay, so that's going to assess what's going on here in the midfoot in addition to the ankle mortis. Okay, so that's how this is going to differ. Okay. And then we did the uh, anterior drawer test. You can do it with the patient back like that where they're on the table like this and you push them down like that. Or Remember when I showed this one, it's kind of, it's, it comes from right here. You're, you're, you're tilting the shoulders. So that's the way that you're going to even stabilize it like this. Because if you remember when we tried that before, you know, you can, people would be doing it like this. You don't quite feel it until you get that whole, it's like a body drop. Okay. All right, then we had the basic, you know, compression, percussion stuff here where you can tap on it here. Okay, what hap What am I doing when I tap right there? Now. What's that? To now. Yeah. And then what particular? Side tarsal oh, tunnel. Tarsal tunnel, right. And then if I go over here. Let's see other nerves here that are coming down like this. Yeah. And then, yeah. you know, you can do this uh, compression here where I'm compressing the tip fib together. So that could be some type of fracture here, or also could be a high ankle sprain. So you can percuss on all these ligaments. And then also bones, bones of the foot. Sometimes you can get a fracture here on the fifth the tarsal. Okay, what else, which one did I leave out? <laughs> yeah. So grab the foot like this. So you're just looking to compress between the toes there, and then you can also pop it here at the same time. Okay. So let's try those if you want, and then um, if you want, as long as you don't do it too many times, you can on my ankle you can do the the. Clagger or deltoid, because that mine's messed up on this side. I don't even know what it was, but just like, yeah, like the little tag on the bottom right hand corner, like more than. Yeah, it's just like Yeah, it was like some. Wow, a lot more last. Because there it has more of a solid endpoint. And there it's just like, when's it going to stop? Yeah. And then do the tail and tail. Because the tips of your, the heels of your thumb are on the tibia, medium mellilis, and then the tips of your thumbs are on the tail. You're trying to, because you're only isolating the nap joint up here. Yeah, I'm done, so. I'm going to try it on this side. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. That one didn't move at all. Okay. Yeah?